I was just watching the President of the United States of America, uh, Barack Obama, and I gotta give him I gotta give him credit. He's uh, he's a strong man because the country's in deep doo doo. It's it's knee deep. <laughs> In fact, it may be higher than ED because it's, uh, it's a, and you know what, the thing about it, I don't even blame the economic collapse of America as we're seeing it now on George Bush. I'm one of those conspiracy theorists. I believe it's much broader than George Bush. Okay, before I get to the economy, I got to do some local stuff here. I, you know, I'm all over the hybrid with my attention deficit, deficit disorder. I got something. I want to talk about Pat Quinn, Pat Quinn, our new governor in Illinois, Pat Quinn. So Pat Quinn, uh, you got to call him. I'm going to put the number up on the screen. This is some local stuff. I know this show is international, but uh, on, on the computer. But he does do some local things here in Chicago and in Illinois. 312-814-2121. No, uh, hopefully I will put it up on the screen here. The phone number. This is the phone number for Pat Quinn. Oh, just it's the it's the state of Illinois office, you know, 100 West Randolph, the state of Illinois office, the James R. Thompson Center, our former governor. Uh, I don't think they're gonna name a building after uh, uh, Rob Bogorovich, maybe a, a wing of a prison or something. And he's a nice enough guy, you know. Too bad he got to go to jail. That's how you know. That's how it goes, right? Well, maybe he may get out of it. Who knows? But the point is, three one two, eight four eight one four. 2121. Call Pat Quinn. If Pat Quinn is a real reformer, like I think he is, Governor Quinn, if Governor Quinn is a real reformer, he wants to reform government in Illinois, he would ask for term limits. Let me just say this again. Term limits, term limits, term limits in the state of Illinois for the state uh, reps and the state senators. And also, here in the city of Chicago, we need State, and of course the state legislature, they make the rules uh, for the city of Chicago, which I don't understand that. I'm not a lawyer. I'm not a legislator. Uh, we need term limits in Chicago for the mayor and for the alderman. I think they should be no more than eight years, two four-year terms. Then they, you know, you can wait maybe four years or eight years. Then you can run again. I think you, you'd be allowed, you should be allowed to run again, but after a four to eight-year period, we just go sit down somewhere. Then if you want to come back, you can come back and run again. I don't think you should be like president where you run, You only uh, have two four-year terms and you can't run for president again. I think you should run for mayor, state senator, state rep again. But they need term limits. Term limits. The phone number is on the screen. I've emailed the governor. I've written the governor. If he really cares about reform, he would uh, implement or call for term limits. If, of course, the state legislators are not going to vote for it, I know that, but he has to call it and put them in check to see if they really want reform, which they don't. Then, if he doesn't want to do that, him or somebody else like Bill Doc Walls here in Chicago, he's an activist, guy, a lawyer, a guy ran for mayor uh, against Mayor Daley last time, last election. Bill Doc Walls, and i got to find Bill Doc Walls, uh, his email. I had it. I got it. It's on the computer, so i got to go find it. If you have his uh, email, Send it to me, email me, give me a call, and give me Bill Doc Walls. His because uh, Bill Doc Walls is an activist. He's a lawyer. He should, if he really cares about reform, if he's grandstanding, if he's just you know like a lot of people on television, they just grandstand. I never met Bill Doc Walls. I've seen him down at Public Access here in Chicago, the TV studio, at a distance, but I never really met the man. So I don't know if he's disingenuous or genuine. I don't know. But if he's if he's ver if he's genuine about reform here in Chicago, he would ask for term limits. You ask for term limits. You email, you call, you write every legislator you can find, the mayor, the governor. Just put pressure right to the, the I think I had something on the computer. You could type it in. They were supposed to put it in the paper. I haven't checked the paper yet. The Tribune, Chicago Tribune was supposed to put something that I wrote about term limits. So I got to go check the Chicago Tribune. You can check the Chicago Tribune. Just type in Chicago Tribune on your computer search engine. Type in Mark Sims and see if it comes up. I'm going to do that when I'm done with this little piece. Term limits. I forgot to watch the clock. I'm supposed to do these like 10 minute segments or something and we shut them off. Okay, so let's, let's, we'll end this segment. We'll go back to the economy in a minute. Let's end this segment about term limits. Term limits, term limits, term limits. Here in Chicago, demand them. Here in Illinois, demand them. We need term limits. I can't stress, stress it enough.